According to the 2021 Zambia Population-Based HIV Impact Assessment Survey, Zambia has made substantial progress towards controlling its HIV pandemic. The report released by Zambian statistics agent Zamstats shows that Zambia has exceeded the second and third target for the Joint United Nations program on the HIV 95-95-95 targets. And Zambia is the second country in the world after the United States and the first in Africa to offer injectable PrEP outside of a study setting. The introduction of this injectable ARV as a novel PrEP option presents an exciting opportunity to expand our arsenal, to expand our arsenal against HIV transmission. Our commitment to tackling the high incidence of HIV remains unwavering. The U.S. government is the largest donor to Zambia's healthy sector, providing services to more than 15 million Zambians. Over the past 10 years, United States President's Emergency Plans for AIDS Relief has helped to reduce HIV incidence in Zambia. Because it is important that people at risk of acquiring HIV are able to choose the HIV prevention method that works best for them. We know that some clients struggle to take a pill every day. They may forget to take their pill daily or they may be concerned about someone finding their pills. With injectable prep, clients receive their injections every two months, making it easier to remember and also making it more discreet. And Central Province Minister Princess Kasuni was present at the handover event. This progress through your ministry, Madam Minister, and indeed sustainable reduction in HIV transmission and enhancing the quality of health, of quality of life for those living with HIV is a clearly testament of the progress that has been made in this country. The injectable PrEP is a safe and effective HIV prevention tool that provides clients with two months of HIV protection between injections. In 2023, nearly 275,000 individuals were initiated on PrEP, with more than 114,000 being adolescents and young people aged between 15 to 24. Ms. Masewo also updated the nation on the cholera situation. A report of 169 new cases countrywide was recorded in the past 24 hours. This again is much lower than the 246 cases that were recorded seven days ago on Friday, 2nd uh, February 2024. Boon Piri, ZNBC News, Chibombo District, Central Province.